guys, I'm Hunter Marsh here on a date with the ever so beautiful Taryn Southern. How Stop. are you? Stop. I brought you a little coffee. That's so sweet of you. Cheers. To a lovely date. To a lovely date. So, I want to ask you, instead of just basic interview questions, we're on a date, I want to get personal. But I want to start with just some advice that you can give me. What's been your worst date experience ever? And I'm going to try and not do that. Oh man, I think my worst date experience ever was when a guy that I wasn't into kept asking me out and I finally said yes because I figured I might as well give him a shot. Everyone deserves a good shot, right? And he picks this really expensive steakhouse. And at the end of the day, it's clear that it's not going to go anywhere, but it was perfectly nice. And I offer, you know, because it's a nice thing to do to, to put in money for it. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, I had a salad and he had like $60 steak. And he accepted it. And I had to split it with him. And he's the one that had been wanting this date for so long and had picked the place and had ordered the expensive food. But I was so angry because it was like, I didn't want to go You didn't want to be there in the first place. place. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well then, at the end of this date, I will pay. Oh, well, you already did. You paid for my soy latte, which was so Cheers nice. again to that. When you flirt with guys, yeah. how do you flirt with them? And I want you to act it out. I think when I flirt, I just make fun of dudes. So go ahead. Yo, could you get a watch that's any bigger? No. So at the end of a date, how do you avoid the kiss being awkward? If you take it that far. If you want the kiss? Mm -hmm. You want the kiss, but you don't want it to be awkward. You definitely have to know who's going to go for it. If the guy seems like he's an aggressive type, you let him take the lead. If he seems to be a bit more passive, but you know he wants it, then you have to take the lead. The worst thing is when you have two people that are like fumbling. Okay, so what are your date deal breakers? Some say someone wants to get the kiss. What shouldn't they do? Well, we obviously know one of them. One of them is not paying on the first date. And then I would say another deal breaker is just like really poor table manners. Anything that could gross me out potentially, or if you smell bad, or you just, there's like, I just generally, if you have a giant pimple whitehead that looks like it needs to be popped. And like you just didn't date, take that. all white and pussy, and it's sticking out. It's like, just pop it, you're on a date. You could have gone and popped it beforehand. That, that grosses me out. Like this video if you agree that that would be a weird thing on a date. Have you ever been set up on a blind date? I feel like I've always seen a photo of the guy though. So it's never been totally blind. I feel it's like not like I've just gone and met up with someone, but I think I've, I've had people say, oh, you guys should meet up. And then there'll be a texting game happening between me and this person before we meet up. That's happened a few times. It's like a glaucoma date. It's not exactly yeah. blind, but you don't have all the details. <laughs> if we're on a date, what's something that applies in all situations? When you're with someone who's just genu genuinely interested in you and is an interesting person and conversation is not difficult, it just mm -hmm. kind of finds its way. If there's nothing to talk about, it's not meant to be. My last question. Yeah. You could go on a date with anyone in the world. Ooh, Who would it be? one. I like that one. Richard Branson. Oh, he is so good though. He's Richard an awesome... Branson. He might be old, but he is sexy, and we would do the date on his plane. One of and them. And I would just, yeah, one of his mini planes. And I just, I think he's so fascinating. I think he lives the craziest life. I would just, I don't know, I'd have fun just picking his brain. So since you guys might not know who Richard Branson is, why don't you let us know who you would want to go on a date with in the comments below. And like this video if you want to see me on more dates with Taryn or anyone else. And if you guys want to see more bonus content from VidCon and all the other stuff we do at Awesomeness TV, make sure to download the app at the App Store, Awesomeness TV app. This was a really nice date. Super nice. Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. I'll get out of my bed. What? Huh?